everyone, and welcome to the 2022 Faculty of Science Awards Night. My name is Kim Gilbride, and I'm the Acting Associate Dean of the Faculty of Science for Undergraduate Programs in Student Affairs, and I am truly honoured to be your host tonight as we celebrate the achievements of our students. The students have worked very hard, and tonight we acknowledge their dedication and successes by presenting them with a memento to highlight their achievements. However, our ability to present these awards to our students in the Faculty of Science is only made possible because of the generous donations from numerous individual donors, alumni, faculty, staff, and organizations. These donations make a significant impact within the Ryerson community, and in particular on the lives of the exceptional students you will meet tonight. On behalf of Ryerson University and the Departments of Chemistry and Biology, computer science, mathematics, and medical physics, we thank all of the donors for their generosity and continued commitment to student success. Now, before we start tonight's celebrations, I'd like to ask Dr. Michael Kolios, our Faculty of Science Associate Dean of Graduate Studies to read Ryerson's land acknowledgement. Take it away, Michael. Thank you, Kim. Toronto, is in the Dish of One Spoon territory. The Dish of One Spoon is a treaty between the Anishinaabe, Mississaugas, and Haudenosaunee that bound them to share the territory and protect the land. Subsequent Indigenous nations and people, Europeans and all newcomers have been invited into this treaty in the spirit of peace, friendship, and respect. Now, I would like to introduce you to Dr. Mohamed Lachemi, the president of the university who has a message for the students. It was just 10 years ago that the Faculty of Science at Ryerson was launched. And because of the amazing students who choose to study here, the faculty has seen incredible growth and success. Today, we honor the best of the best. La crème de la crème. To the award winners, congratulations and also to your families who are joining us today. I want to thank our talented faculty and staff for the encouragement and inspiration you give our students every single day. And on behalf of our university, my deepest gratitude to the award donors. This is a very special moment to honor our wonderful and talented students in the Faculty of Science. Please enjoy the celebration. Thank you. Good evening, and I would like to add my welcoming words uh, to this evening's awards ceremony. Always one of the favorite times of the year for me. Um, I, I'm happy that we have this chance to celebrate with everybody. And I'm looking forward to the next time when we'll be able to do this in person. So we're so very proud of the students' accomplishments um, during these hard times of the pandemic. And we're very much interested in your personal stories on how you got here, what your support systems were, et cetera. And by this way, I mean um, to acknowledge the family members and friends that have supported you and are here probably watching you tonight. So we take great pride in you. Thank you very much. And also thanks to the donors, um, without which many of these awards wouldn't exist. Their contributions, both uh, monetarily and philosophically to these awards mean so very much to us. So to get on with the evening and the awards, I'm going to hand it over to the faculty members who will announce the awards and the winners. Thank you. I'm Sarah Sabatino in the Department of Chemistry and Biology. Each year, Faculty of Science students are eligible for university-wide awards, which are open to all university students. The President's Entrance Scholarship for domestic students are awarded to secondary school graduates who demonstrate academic accomplishment, leadership qualities, original thought, and creative ability. The award recipient is Summerly Ertl in Biomedical Sciences. Congratulations.
Each year, Faculty of Science students are eligible for university-wide awards, which are open to all Ryerson University students. The President's Entrance Scholarships International are awarded to secondary school graduates who demonstrate academic accomplishment, leadership qualities, original thought, and creative ability. This year, one of these scholarships is awarded to Dia Prabhu in Biomedical Sciences. Congratulations! Hello and welcome. My name is Dustin Little and I am an assistant professor in the Department of Chemistry and Biology. It is my honor to introduce the Bruce Beauchamp Memorial Award. This award was established through the Bruce Beauchamp Memorial Fund, set up in memory of Bruce Beauchamp, who passed away from cancer in 1988. The fund was established as a tribute to Bruce's generosity of spirit, which touched everyone he met. The recipient of this award is a full-time undergraduate student registered in biology, biomedical science, or the medical physics program, and who has completed their third year of study. The student demonstrates academic and research excellence in the life sciences with a priority given to excellence in cancer-related knowledge and or research. I am pleased to announce this year's award recipient is Mihir Pandya from Biomedical Sciences. Congratulations, Mihir. Connections in Science Award is presented to a fourth-year full-time undergraduate student in the Bachelor of Science program who has achieved a minimum cumulative GPA of 3.67 at the end of their third year of study. The recipient of this award demonstrates strength in understanding connected science through an academic history that is multidisciplinary in nature, such as extensive coursework in two or more disciplines and through roles that integrate science with extracurricular activities such as mentorship, volunteer work, or governance. This year's recipient is Jordan Langtot in medical physics. The award for creativity in science was established by the Dean of the Faculty of Science to recognize students who apply creativity in their understanding and pursuit of an education in science. This year's award recipient is D'Angelo Da Silva in the program Computer Science. Congratulations, D'Angelo. I'm most grateful to be given this moment so that I can express my appreciation. First to Ryerson as an institution for providing students, especially those with financial needs, with opportunities to receive support and financial assistance. But most importantly, I would like to thank Dr. David Cram for his generous support and for awarding me with the Dean's Award for Creativity in the Faculty of Science. I am most honored. Thank you very much. Hi. My name's Alex Fairwarn, and I'm a professor in the Department of Computer Science. Um, why I'm talking to you today is about Jeff Boyce. Um, Jeff Boyce was a professor in the Department of Mathematics, Physics, and Computer Science when I was a student at Ryerson Polytechnic Institute. I first met Professor Boyce in my third year of the program um, when I was taking his class, Math 503 Operations Research. Uh, a quick Google search of operations research leads one to believe that it is the practice of applying math to business decisions. Um, what made the course interesting to me was the way Professor Boyce would apply optimization to all manner of decisions. Uh, for example, we spent a class optimizing a decision that everyone who has ever spent time in the stall of a public washroom has been asked to make. Which role do you use? Do I use the new role or do I optimize by using the uh, smaller but pre-used role? Um, while not critical decisions, it actually caused me to remember uh, Professor Jeff uh, until this day. So the first Jeff Boys Award is the Jeff Boys International Student Leadership Award. Recipients of this award have demonstrated leadership qualities and made community building contributions to the faculty of science community. 
This year's recipients are Farhan Sami from Computer Science and Nezwari Sathuraman from Biomedical Science. C congratulations. Warm greetings, everyone. I am Farhan Sami, and I am honored to be the recipient of this award. I am grateful to Dr. Boyce, his family, and the sponsors for taking the initiative and making this award possible. I'm also grateful to the Ryerson Science Society, Pam, and the university in general for uh, providing me with all the opportunities to grow my skills and contribute. I'm truly honored and I'm truly grateful. Thank you so much. Hi everyone. I'm honored to be receiving the Jeff Boys Leadership Award this year. He has given recognition to the effort that I've put in thus far in university. It has also inspired me to continue believing in myself as I work hard towards the completion of my degree and as I seek out new endeavors. Thank you. The second Jeff Boys Award is the Jeff Boys International Entrance Award, which is presented to an international student who is enrolled in their first year of a Faculty of Science program. This year's award is presented to Mohamed Narkuzi from Computer Science and Nidhi Biswas in Computer Science. The Imogen R. Co. Award in Equity, Diversity and Inclusion was established in honor of the founding Dean of the Faculty of Science, Dr. Imogen R. Co. The award is presented to a full-time student who has made an impact on the Ryerson community. Recipients may demonstrate this impact through activities that foster an inclusive environment, advance the understanding of equity, diversity and inclusion, increase accessibility, engage underrepresented groups or communities in STEM education and or career pathways. This year's recipient is Ramisa Razi from Biomedical Sciences. The Noel Award in Science was established by Fern Noel, an alumnus of Chemical Laboratory Technology 57. He created this award to directly assist students studying science at Ryerson, recognizing from his own time at Ryerson some of the challenges and financial burdens students face in pursuit of their degree. The recipient of this award is a full-time student registered in a Bachelor of Science program that is in good academic standing, has made a positive contribution to the Faculty of Science and or the university community through involvement in student leadership activities or in academic program activities such as competitions. This year's award is presented to two students, Samantha Sinehi in Biomedical Sciences and Shamal Khan, also in Biomedical Sciences. Congratulations to both of you. The Rani Yip Award in Science was generously established by Rani Yip, an alumnus of Applied Computer Science class of 1982. As a director for the Ryerson University Alumni Association, Rani endeavors to support Ryerson students in any way he can. Each year, the Rani Yip Award in Science will support a third or fourth year student from the Faculty of Science who is in good academic standing with a minimum cumulative GPA of 3.0. This year recipient is Elena Ivanova in Biomedical Sciences. Congratulations. The Science Outreach Award of Excellence is granted by our SciExchange team to recognize students who display outstanding initiative and leadership in promoting science both within and beyond the Ryerson community. This year's recipient is Aline Shaquille from Biomedical Sciences. Congratulations, Aline.
The Stallenbachter Faculty of Science Award was created in honor of Dr. Stallenbachter, Dean of the Faculty of Engineering, Architecture and Science from 2002 to 2009 through the generous donations from family and friends. The recipient of this award is a fourth year student enrolled in the Faculty of Science who has demonstrated academic excellence in their third year of study, as well as overall excellent academic performance. This year's recipient is Adam Varghese in Biomedical Sciences. Congratulations, Adam. Good evening to everyone, and I just want to say congratulations to all award recipients for receiving a scholarship. I also want to say thank you to the late Stallenbachter and his family for receiving the Stallenbachter Science Award. With this award, I want to pursue further opportunities to conduct research and work in the field of science. Once again, I'd just like to say thank you, and I hope to not let any of you down and continue to do the best that I can. Hi, this is Nariman Parsad from the Department of Computer Science. The first year entrance award in the Faculty of Science is presented to first year students in the Faculty of Science who have achieved a minimum secondary school admission average of 80% and are alumni of the FIRST Robotics program and have outlined the impact their FIRST Robotics experience has had on their future goals. This year's recipient is Daniel Boxer in Computer Science. Congratulations, Daniel. The said entrance award in the Faculty of Science goes to a first year student who is enrolled full time in a program in the Faculty of Science and who is alumni of the said program. A guiding principle of the Faculty of Science is equality, diversity, and inclusivity in science, and we are committed to ensuring science is accessible to everyone, particularly those from underrepresented groups. Priority will be given to students from the underrepresented groups. This year, the award goes to Brandon Lee in computer science. Congratulations, Brandon. Digitry has grown to become a digital credential expert and a leading online platform for certifying, sharing, and verifying academic credentials. The Digitry Women in Computer Science Award will support a commencing female computer science student who demonstrates financial need. I'm pleased to announce this year's award recipient is Roxy Reginald from Computer Science. Congratulations, Roxy. The UMA Foundation Awards were established by Satish Bala, Computer Science 09. These awards are presented to first-generation students in the Faculty of Science who have demonstrated how their experiences have influenced their pursuit of post-secondary education. The award recipients are Anthony Tay from Biology and Sudhira De Silva Dewan Ariana from Biomedical Science. Congratulations.
thank you for joining us for the presentation of the awards in the Department of Chemistry and Biology. My name is Andrew Williams, and as the chair of the department, I would like to thank all the donors that provided support for the awards, which honor the achievements of students in the chemistry, biology, and biomedical science programs. Tonight, we are recognizing 23 recipients across 16 award categories, all of whom demonstrated academic excellence in the past year. And so, I would like to return to our faculty members who will announce our departmental awards and their winners. The awards for women in chemistry and biology were established by Sayida Buda in the biology program in 2015. These awards are presented to students in any year of a chemistry, biology, or biomedical sciences program who identify as female and who demonstrate their commitment to promoting education and how they challenge outdated assumptions that persist around women in STEM. The award recipients are Romy Sarazi from Biomedical Sciences and Samantha Hernandez in Biology. Congratulations and keep up the good work. The Frank G. Routon Award was established in 1985 by Frank Routon, a former faculty member in the Applied Chemical and Biological Science Department for 27 years. This award is presented to the student who demonstrates the highest academic achievement in the second year analytical chemistry course. The awards go to Stacey Campbell and Reese Brandy, both in chemistry. Congratulations. The Eugene Woody Porrick Memorial Prize Award goes to the student who's attained the highest grades in Organic Chemistry 1 and 2. The award this year goes to Reese Grandy in Chemistry. The Dr. Robert A. Greer Scholarship Award was established in memory of Dr. Robert Greer Chair of the Department of Chemistry, Biology, and Chemical Engineering from 1997 to 2002 through a generous donation from his family and friends. This award is presented to the student who has achieved the highest standing in a fourth year thesis and who has enrolled in graduate school. The award recipient is Valerie Morozova in chemistry. Congratulations, Valerie. This award was established by Sarwan Sohoda, a past chair of the Department of Chemistry, Biology, and Chemical Engineering. The award is presented to an undergraduate student who is enrolled in the Bachelor of Science degree program in the Department of Chemistry and Biology. This year, the award recipient is Michelle Murgowski in Biomedical Science. Congratulations, Michelle. Dear Sarwan S. Sahota, Thank you very much for selecting me for this award and for your generous contribution. As a full-time student who participates in extracurricular activities and works, I find myself commuting frequently. Your contribution will help me to subsidize my transport fees and to continue staying involved on and off campus. I'd like to thank you again and I'm very honored to have received your award. The Chemistry and Biology Faculty Research Awards recognize both research and academic excellence in the fields of chemistry, biology, and biomedical science. The recipients of these awards are full-time students in the Department of Chemistry and Biology who have a minimum CGPA of 3.0, have completed all first-year credits, and have completed a body of research. The award recipients are Samantha Senehi in Biomedical Sciences and Mahir Pandya in Biomedical Sciences.
The chemistry and biology faculty research awards recognize both research and academic excellence in the field of chemistry, biology, and biomedical science. The recipients of these awards are full-time students in the Department of Chemistry and Biology who have a minimum CGPA of 3.0, completed all first-year credits, and have completed a body of research. The award recipient from the biology program is Anthony Tai. Congratulations. Thank you to everybody at the Faculty of Biology and Chemistry for making my research project possible. Uh, especially during COVID, I super appreciate Dr. Janet Kopernikar, my research supervisor, and uh, Rachel Goldberg, who's my mentor in the lab, for um, all the training and the support, encouragement, uh, and for making my um, uh, research safe and uh, possible. Uh, receiving this award has been a huge honor, so thank you for everybody involved. Hopefully I'm making you guys proud. The Chemistry and Biology Faculty Research Awards recognizes both research and academic excellence in the fields of chemistry, biology, and biomedical science. The recipients of these awards are full-time students in the Department of Chemistry and Biology who have a minimum CGPA of 3.0, have completed all of their first year credits, and have completed a body of research. The award recipient from the chemistry program is Mohammed Noman. Congratulations, Mohammed, and we wish you every success in the future. The Chemistry and Biology Faculty Awards recognize academic excellence and community building in the fields of chemistry, biology, and biomedical sciences. The recipients of these awards are full-time students in the Department of Chemistry and Biology who have a minimum CGPA of 3.5 and have completed all first-year credits. The award recipients are James Truong and Maria Pegkatipunen in biology. Hi, I'm Maria, and I'm pleased to be selected for the Biology Award in Faculty of Science. Um, I'd like to thank the University and the Chemistry and Biology Department for selecting me for this award. Um, I'm very grateful, and it is very motivating, especially in my final semester in my undergraduate career. Um, thank you, and congratulations to everyone else who will be receiving an award today. The Chemistry and Biology Faculty Awards recognize academic excellence and community building in the fields of chemistry, biology, and biomedical science. The recipients of these awards are full-time students in the Department of Chemistry and Biology who have a minimum CGPA of 3.5 and have completed all first-year credits. The award recipient is Talha Mahmoud in chemistry. Congratulations. The Chemistry and Biology Faculty Awards recognize academic excellence in community building in the fields of chemistry, biology, and biomedical science. The recipients of these awards are full-time students in the Department of Chemistry and Biology who have a minimum cumulative GPA of 3.5 and have completed all first-year credits. The award recipients for the Biomedical Sciences program this year are Larry Nguyen and Sophia Kim. Congratulations! This award is presented to a third year student in chemistry, biology, or biomedical science with the highest CGPA and who has taken all the science courses up to their year. The award recipients are Alain Shaquille in biomedical sciences and Nasli Robin in biomedical sciences. Congratulations.
This award is granted to full-time undergraduate students in chemistry, biology, or biomedical sciences in clear academic standing who have completed their third year of studies and who demonstrate financial need. Students must demonstrate an interest in and intention to pursue medical studies. The award recipient is Suha Suleiman Lalani in biomedical sciences. As an international student alumnus, Jason G is passionate about giving back to students from other countries in support of their international experience at Ryerson. This award has been created to support an environmental science international student with the goal that this award will inspire and support students in applying their knowledge to help combat environmental changes such as global warming in either Canada or abroad. The award recipient is Alexandra Panariti in biology. The Chemical Institute of Canada Book Prize is awarded to the student with the second highest standing in a chemistry related program in their penultimate year. This year's recipient is William Chen in chemistry. Congratulations, William. The Canadian Society for Chemistry Silver Medal is presented to students who have achieved the highest academic standing in a chemistry-related program in the penultimate year of their four-year program or in their final year of a college program. This year's recipient is Stacy Combo from Chemistry. Congratulations, Stacy. I'm Dr. Dave Mason. I'm chair of the Department of Computer Science, and I'd like to welcome you all to this awards presentation. First of all, of course, congratulations to the award winners. Uh, you join a, a long line of award winners uh, at Ryerson. I've been here a very long time, and I've watched uh, many of our award winners go on to do great things. Some have started companies, some have gone on to grad school, and some have just been successful in their lives in, uh, in great ways. I'd also like to thank the sponsors for creating the uh, potential for us to give these awards to our deserving students. So without more ado, I will let us proceed with the actual awards. Congratulations again. The Sudhara Kaneris Memorial Award was established in memory of Sudhara Kaneris, who passed away in 1977. The award is presented to a student enrolled full-time in the computer science program who has the highest overall standing in mathematics in the first four semesters. The award recipient is Dao Nguyen Fan. Dr. Philip H. Byrne Memorial Award was established in honor of Dr. Philip Byrne, a long serving faculty member in the Department of Mathematics, Physics and Computer Science. The award is presented to a computer science student who has demonstrated proficiency in physics theory and lab. This award goes to Yu Chen Zhao. Jack Roy Longstaff Memorial Scholarship is presented to a computer science student who demonstrates outstanding academic performance in their third year of study. This year's recipient is Katerina Shkinova. Congratulations. The Lucia Flame Award was named for and created by former Department of Computer Science Administrative Staff Member Lucia Flame. 
In May of 2015, Lucia retired from the Department of Computer Science after 35 plus years and established this award to relieve the financial pressure on students she saw each day. Each year, this award will go to a female student who demonstrates academic excellence and a commitment to extracurricular activities at Ryerson. This award goes to Jenny Long. Congratulations, Jenny. Thank you, Lucia, for providing this opportunity and selecting me for the Lucia Flam Award. This award will truly help me progress my future in computer science. Once again, thank you so much, Lucia. The Finlandson Innovation in User Experience Award was named for and created by Alex Finlandson, a computer science alumni class 2006. Alex established this award to recognize students in the Department of Computer Science who think about using existing technology in a new way to build innovative experiences, similarly as Alex does in his daily life as a UX engineer at Google. This year's recipients are Alif Munif and Muhammad Khan. Congratulations. Hello everyone, my name is Alif Munim. I'm in my fourth year of Ryerson's Computer Science Co-op Program, and I'm delighted to be part of this year's Virtual Awards Ceremony. I'm honored to be receiving this year's Finlayson Innovation in UX Award, and I would like to sincerely thank the donor, Alex Finlayson, for his generosity, as well as Google for their contribution. Thank you for uplifting students like myself, and for inspiring us to continue using our passion for technology to help ignite change and make the world a better place. It makes a huge difference. Greetings. It is an honor for me to present the award for academic perseverance in computer science, which was established by Jason Ma Computer Science Bachelor of Degree 2003 and Masters in Computer Science 2014. The award was established as a way to alleviate the pressure students face in the pursuit of their degree. It is presented to a student in their second year of study in the Department of Computer Science. This year, the award goes to Harry Pino Rosado. Congratulations and well done. Faculty, staff, and alumni in the Department of Computer Science have generously contributed to providing the Department of Computer Science Entrance Scholarship to two female students who are enrolled in the first year of the Computer Science program at Ryerson and demonstrate academic excellence in the final year of high school. These year's recipients are Iram Mahamud and Dorsa Mahalamari. Congratulations. This is Vivian Hu from the Department of Computer Science. The Women in Computer Science Award is awarded to outstanding full-time female students enrolled in the Computer Science undergraduate program. The recipient of this award demonstrates academic excellence and outstanding service towards the advancement of women in computer science. This year's recipient is Jenny Long. Congratulations, Jenny. Hi, thank you for selecting me for the Women in Computer Science Award. I really appreciate it and I will strive to work hard through my academics as well as empowering other women in pursuing their goals in computer science. Thank you once again. The recipients of the School of Computer Science Award first year are the top three first year students who receive the highest marks in Computer Science 1, CPS 1 and 9, Computer Science 2, CPS 2 and 9, and have maintained a clear academic standing. The recipients are Pancho Fernandez, Arshpreet Singh, and Yu Chen Zhao. Congratulations.
the School of Computer Science Award second year is presented to the top three students who have demonstrated the strongest academic performance in their second year of study. And the recipients this year are Hamza Shafiq, Tao Nguyen Pham, and Harman Sarah. Congratulations. The Alumni Award is presented to top three students who have demonstrated the best overall performance in Computer Organization 1 CPS 213 and Computer Organization 2 CPS 310. The recipients are Sher Safi, Igor Polvin, and Harbaksh Singh. Congratulations. Faculty of Science Awards participants. First of all, I would like to extend my heartfelt congratulations and also congratulations on behalf of the entire math department to all the award recipients, their parents, supervisors, and all of those who have supported them in their pursuit of academic excellence. After a rather challenging couple of years, we're hoping, and I hope you share this sentiment with me, that the Science Award Ceremony will be a sign of great things to come in the new year 2022. I would also like to extend my deepest gratitude to all the award donors and their families, and without whose support, the celebration of student accomplishments would be impossible. Next, without further ado, I'm inviting Dr. Pablo Olivares to present Paul and Anna Maria Bonato Mathematics Award. Thank you. The Paul and Anna Maria Bonato Mathematics Scholarship Award is presented to full-time students currently enrolled in their fourth year of study with the Department of uh, Mathematics, who have achieved the highest CGPA at the end of the third year maintained a clear academic record and have taken all mathematics courses up to their fourth year as outlined in the Ryerson undergrad calendar. This year's uh, recipient is Radu Islam in mathematics and its applications. Congratulations, Radu. Good evening. The Math Guru Award for Women in Mathematics is presented to a full-time undergraduate mathematics student in their second, third, or fourth year of the program who has a clear academic standing and a minimum CGPA of 3.0. The recipient must demonstrate an outstanding contribution to the lives of women in the mathematics program and to Ryerson University as a whole in terms of leadership and volunteering. I'm pleased to share that this year's award recipient is Amtaj Kaur in mathematics and its applications. Congratulations, Amtaj. The Howard Care Memorial Scholarship was established in honor of Howard Care, the first principal of the Ryerson Institute of Technology. The recipient of this award is a full-time student enrolled in their third year of study with the Department of Mathematics, who has achieved the highest CGPA at the end of the second year 
maintained a clear academic record and have taken all mathematics courses up to the third year as outlined in the Ryerson undergraduate calendar. The award recipient is King Kun Yang in financial mathematics. The Mathematics Faculty Scholarship is presented to two full-time students currently enrolled in their second year of study with the Department of Mathematics. The recipients of this award have achieved the highest cumulative GPA at the end of their first year, maintain a clear academic record, and have taken all mathematic courses up to their second year as aligned in the Ryerson undergraduate calendar. This year's recipients are Joe Capucin in financial mathematics, Alexander Popovics in mathematics and its applications, and Cesar Emmanuel Tan in mathematics and its applications. The Geoff Boyd's Excellence in Student Research Award was established in the memory of retired mathematics professor Geoff Boyd, who passed away in 2014. The award is presented to a students registered in the Department of Mathematics who are undergoing or completing research deemed to be the highest quality and the best among the nominees for this year. This year's recipient is Jun Alejandro Liao in mathematics and its applications. Congratulations to Jun. Moreover, I would like to congratulate all the award recipients and I'm proud of all your excellent performance. Good evening to everyone. It is an immense pleasure to share this night with all of you. The Faculty of Science Award Night Ceremony is a traditional event that takes place annually. Even with the pandemic and shift to online learning, we are still more than ever committed to honoring and recognizing our students' achievements. As some of you may know, my name is Dr. Anna Pejovic Milic and I'm a faculty member and chair of the Department of Physics. However, tonight is about our students, so let me continue. I would first like to welcome all the award winners, students, donors, and guests. I also want to express my gratitude to those parents and professors who have made a lot of effort to support, teach, and develop the personality of the young talents present with us this evening. The Fred N. Hensworld Award was established by former Ryzen Professor Emeritus Fred N. Hensworth to recognize the academic excellence achieved by students in their fourth year of study in the medical physics program. The recipient is a student with a CGPA in the A- range who is committed to pursuing graduate studies. This year's award recipient is Gaurav Virsing. Congratulations, Gaurav. The Physics Faculty Scholarship third year was established by donations from faculty and staff in the Department of Physics and recognizes third year full-time undergraduate students enrolled in the Medical Physics program who have achieved the highest CGPA at the end of their second year of study. This year's recipients are Iyaman Al-Mazri and Caitlin Sims.
The V6 Faculty Scholarship second year was established by donations from faculty and staff in the Department of Physics and recognized the second year full-time undergraduate students enrolled in the medical physics program who have achieved the highest cumulative GPA at the end of their first year of study. This year's recipient is Helen Molino. Congratulations once again. everyone welcome back i hope you enjoyed the the presentations and uh, before we leave i just have a couple of thank yous i'd like to extend to people behind the scenes so first of all i'd like to thank all the departmental and uh, the faculty uh, award selection committee uh, they spent hours looking through the applications and selecting the award winners that you uh, that we honored tonight then i'd also like to thank our the team the team behind me that does everything that would be rose tam who uh, manage to organize all the videos, put them in order, uh, communicate with the students, the faculty, and the donors to make sure that they uh, gave us the videos to put in tonight's production. Also like to thank uh, Casey Karash, who's our alumni and development officer in the Faculty of Science, who made sure that the donors were uh, aware of what was going on and to thank them again for their generous uh, donations. And then for the production tonight, big, big thank you to two of our very own Ryerson students, Jaden Walls and Melissa Yatsi, who were the brains and the work behind uh, making sure all the videos were put in sequence and uh, fading in and out our music and all of our uh, background images that you that you saw tonight. Um, and then I'd like to also thank from CCS Brian Boyce, who's the person who's live streaming for us and is also monitoring our chat. Big big thank you for our whole team. And last but not least, thank you to all of you who helped us tonight, who participated and helped congratulate all of our students. It just made uh, this event so wonderful. So thank you and have a great year uh, to everyone else. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.